insurance company owner. Um, emergency medical response officer. Thank you. Take ten, like ten, please, ten fire. Yeah. So how many we have left now? Four, seven. So if we like. or did you shelter them in place? We tried to shelter them in place. We had a little bit of this They had to switch plans. I understand. So you, you re reconnected them with their parents? Yeah. And how many categories were you guys able to complete? Five out of five. Five? <laughs> Four <A> more. <laughs> Despite all that damage? <laughs> all right, very nicely done, Sunny Rook. Excellent job. We had to choose between reuniting children with their parents or sheltering them. Mm -hmm. um, we thought as a group, and I as the governor, um, <laughs> thought the more moral choice was to shelter the children. Coming disaster. And, uh, um, so we decided things like snow were probably not a big issue, and so we focused more on flooding since we were close to water and tried to fix things like that. So you guys used the information about the city to really guide your decision-making process. Great. You're preparing before the event hits, you don't know what you're preparing for, so those resources could be um, completely not unnecessary mm -hmm. for what you actually needed. So. so just looking at what's on the table, there were things we didn't even need, right? Things we spent our city's money on that didn't even come to fruition. 